keep flipping the odds. Oh, what's this? Oh, yeah. The V8, uh, I guess now this winter, they're going to be coming out with a brand new placebo. Yes. Uh, and they say it's actually going to be a real placebo. Whatever the hell that's supposed to mean. <laughs> this portion of the Captain Boomers podcast, the therapy co- uh, podcast, that was brought to you by none other than the Weenie Genie. Yes, you guys having trouble down below? You know what I'm talking about. You betcha. That guy. That guy down there, that little general, he doesn't want to snap to and and to attention anymore. We will get that boy back up and running in no time. All you got to do is just check out the amazing Weenie Genie. It is all natural product put out by our own, uh, Captain Booker's Podcast's own in-house physician, Dr. Lance Boyles. Yes, Dr. Lance Boyles. And he came up with this. Uh, 100% natural, erectile to functional uh, pill, and it's just marvelous. And anyways, uh, yeah, check it out. The amazing Weenie Genie. Oh, yeah, you'll be thinking boing, boing, boing all night long. Uh, and <laughs> well, you know what I mean. <laughs> you guys want a part-time job? This is only for my boomers out there. Part-time job, and it's going to be coming up pretty quick, guys. Yeah, it is. It, well, they've been catching on for years, but now so. See, the whole market's going to change for us because us boomers, like 74 million of us, oh, we're going to be lots of new inventions and stuff. Well, look at all the crap we got now. Like, being away, if we take so many meds right now, yeah. Uh, we just, you, you remember what a lazy Susan was? Yeah, we just got a big lazy Susan in the middle of the dining room table. We put our meds in it. Sometimes we play musical meds. I take her, she takes mine. I don't care. What the hell? We're retired. Anyway, uh, yeah. <laughs> anyway, here's a job for us. You guys uh, interested in being a clapper repair man? Yes, it's part time, but still pays about twelve bucks an hour. Yes, it does. Clapper repair man, part time. You know, clap, clapper guys, right? Clap on, clap off. Yeah, that's it right there. I'm telling you. And here's some sad news. The pig lot and workshops that were in the Twin Cities area, yeah, they're all closed down thanks to COVID. So that's not good. What else we got here? I had another part-time job here somewhere. Where the hell is it? I know I did. It was a pretty good one, too. Anyway. Oh, here's one for you ladies out there. Okay? Ma Kettle has just... Ma Kettle has just announced... That she has got her own, her own line of lingerie out there. Can you imagine that? Can you imagine that? Yeah, Ma Kettle's got her own line of lingerie out there, and I'm pretty sure the wife's got some upstairs. I mean, I'm telling you, in the closet. Oh God. Uh, but it lasts forever because supposedly it's made out of. It's made out of gunny sacks. There you go. You guys that know was that easy. stuff. You betcha. Oh, that's no good. Twine ball bus tours. They are going to be up and running here this spring, so they say. Uh, you guys want to get out there and check out those twine balls out there? Yep. Uh, yeah. Anyway, Mars Magazine that stands for Medicated and Retired Seniors. Mars Magazine says about Captain Boomer, so Captain Captain lets all his meds do the talking. And ain't that a fact? And anyway, Captain Boomer's is a medicated media production. Yes indeed. There he is to help me guy. You betcha. Anyway, a big kiss out to Donna. Linda, my cousin Susie Q, big wolf whistle babes, and a big kiss out there also for all the lovely nurses that took care of us in Vietnam, the donut dollies, God bless you gals, the army nurses, God bless you gals, and the Red Cross nurses, bless you gals, all right, let's go do it all over again, for all you gals I just mentioned, here you go, God bless you. Lots of kisses coming your way, babe. 
There you go. God bless you, gals. I gotta sign off now. Okay. All right, you guys have yourself a great, uh, great Wednesday, and have even a better tomorrow, uh, Thanksgiving Day, because. <sighs> No matter what's going on, we look at those numbers and their and the stats and the, and it's bleak and that things aren't looking too good. But I'm telling you, remember, guys, I tell you, we all got something to be thankful for. We really do, and and I hope you reflect upon that tomorrow as uh, as you bow your heads, thank the big guy. Remember, it is we are going through some some tough times, that's for sure. But just remember that. Some people got it a lot worse than us. Yes, there are always somebody else out there. And I'm going to close up with my beautiful whistling of my one of my favorite kid shows watching whatever. Well, not kid, but anyway. All right, here we go. There you go. All right, I got a ditty mouth.